Hey, what's up, guys? Happy Monday to you. Glad that you decided to start your week right here with us on Everyday Faith. Uh, we have a great scripture from James chapter 1, verse 5. It says, If you need wisdom, ask our generous God, and he will give it to you. He will not rebuke you for asking. When was the last time you asked God for wisdom or clarity around his purposes for your life? Don't worry if your answer is a long time ago or never. Most of us don't realize or we tend to forget that God wants to speak into our purpose. As James wrote, God is a generous God, and he is generous in every way. When we ask for wisdom or clarity, God will give it to us in abundance. He will not withhold from us the understanding we need to fulfill what he has called us to do. I love that line, so I'm going to read it again. God will not withhold from us the understanding we need to fulfill what he has called us to do. God is approachable, and he wants to hear from you. And not only does he want to hear from you, but he wants to respond with what you need to move forward. Take a moment to pray and ask God for wisdom or clarity surrounding his purpose for you. Man, I love this devotion. I want, and it reminded me of a story, uh, a situation when I, that I faced when I was 18 years old. Uh, so this is 15, 16 years ago now. Um, I was just recently graduated high school. I was getting ready to go off to a ministry college. I knew I wanted to be a pastor, or I thought at the time a youth pastor. Um, and I remember talking with my pastor at the time and, and asking him, his name is Dan. I said, Dan, like, why doesn't God just tell us everything? Like, I know this is what I'm supposed to do now, but why doesn't God just kind of give us the whole picture? And I think that's something that we all wrestle with, right? It's like, I think like I have this kind of like partial uh, view of what I'm supposed to do. And why doesn't God just tell me the whole thing? Cause then I would do it. And Dan just responded to me and he said, Ricky, he's like, I think, you know, honestly, if God just told us, we'd be too chicken to follow it. And I remember, you know, 18 years old, like I'm not afraid of anything. I would totally do it. And now I look back over the last 16 years and the journey that God has taken me on and where I've had the situations I've had to step into, the, the challenges I've had to face and overcome. And I realized I totally would have been afraid. I totally would have been so scared of those things. And I just would have completely pushed away. But I love what this devotion says is that God speaks in and he gives clarity and wisdom. But then it says this, that God um, gives us in that third paragraph, he said he wants to respond with what you need to move forward. It's just enough to take the next step. And that's all faith is. Faith is simply doing what Jesus tells us to do next. We don't have to have the whole picture resolved. We don't have to have it all figured out. We just need to know that this is my next step of obedience. This is my next step of faith. And so long as I do that, God will continue to reveal and speak and provide wisdom and clarity around the purposes that he has for us. So today, whatever you're doing, wherever you are, just commit to taking the next step of faith and let God speak into that. We'll see you guys tomorrow.